your weather authority forecast with meteorologist Zach Gilday. Certified most accurate by WeatherAid. Looking pretty quiet right now, but some weather might be impacting sports pretty soon for that next Razorback football game. I'll show you that in just a minute. But for right now, for us, again, pretty quiet. Mid-40s, dew point is at 42. Humidity is at 90%. So we are seeing a little bit of fog in some areas and some areas of drizzle. So kind of a raw and chilly evening, especially with that breeze not really feeling the best for us. Here is a Fort Smith view. A little bit warmer. That cooler air hasn't quite reached Fort Smith right now 59 degrees Poto is at 61 so quite the difference in those temps it is chilly in northwest Arkansas but River Valley is still pretty mild now tonight that north breeze will hang on and because of that it will be ushering in that colder air tomorrow it will stay breezy throughout the morning decreasing winds though during the afternoon and because of that wind there will be a wind chill factor tonight we're going to be dropping down to around 30 for some and with that wind it will feel like the mid 20s so here Here's daybreak on your Thanksgiving. It's going to be a cold start. I would definitely bundle up for the morning and then during the afternoon. It's really not going to warm all that much. Highs in the 40s and the wind chill will be in the mid 30s tomorrow afternoon. So it's going to be a colder Thanksgiving, but we're not expecting any kind of precip. And here is that Thanksgiving Day forecast. So cold turkey, if not heated, but I'm sure you will be heating it up in that oven. Temperatures, again, 40s, decreasing cloud cover. There should be plenty of sun, but with that north breeze, it will stay quite cold. Now for us, here is right now. We have a low pressure area moving through really quickly. We have some rain to our north. Now here's what happens with that storm system. It will quickly move east. Here is midnight, seeing snow across the Ohio Valley, rain down through the Tennessee Valley. And then by daybreak on Thanksgiving, this big system impacting New York City, New England, a whole lot of rain for that parade tomorrow and there will be some winds too a lot of snow for new york vermont new hampshire up in the Maine. so active weather for new england but for us and for areas south it's looking pretty quiet now here's what's happening tonight back in northwest arkansas just some light drizzle possible and then by midnight northwest arkansas should dry out maybe some drizzle towards the morning in the river valley but by late morning the whole forecast area looks dry decreasing cloud cover throughout the day here's what's happening what what happens this weekend another system moving in that looks north of us but that looks to be cold and there is some energy with that so here's some snow for portions of Missouri that could impact that Arkansas Razorback game if you have plans maybe traveling up there pay attention to that forecast as that changes and we can see for us again looking dry this weekend I think all that snow and rain should be to our north next week cold weather settles in that looks to be here to stay with those lows in the teens and highs in the 40s how do you feel about that sonia as we go into december i know you're probably not used to these Definitely teens not. in the morning hours